In the previous lecture, we discussed the concept known as motional EMF that is induced inside a wire as a result of a moving conductor. Now, let's look at an application. So, a movable conducting rod is traveling to the right with an unknown velocity V as shown in the following diagram. So we have a U-shaped conducting wire and we place a conducting rod onto our U-shaped conducting wire. And this rod moves to the right along the x-axis with some unknown velocity v. Now this entire system lies within an external magnetic field b that points out of the board as shown by the following blue dots. Now. If the magnetic field is uniform and equal to 0.5 teslas, if the length of the rod, if this length is given by 20 centimeters, and the induced EMF within our wire is 60 millivolts, we want to calculate the speed of our conductor, the magnitude of our unknown velocity. So to calculate the magnitude of our velocity, we simply apply the equation that we derived in the previous lecture. So the induced EMF is equal to the product of the magnetic field B, our length L, and the velocity V. So we take this equation, solve it for V, and we see that the velocity or the magnitude of velocity of our moving conductor is equal to the induced EMF divided by the product of the magnetic field B and the length L. Now our induced voltage is 60 millivolts. So we have to convert that into volts and we divide by 1000 and we get 0 0.06 volts. Now our magnitude of our magnetic field is 0 0.5 teslas and our length of the rod is 20 centimeters. So we convert that to meters by dividing this number by 100 and we get 0 0.2 meters. So 0 0.06 volts divided by 0 0.5 teslas multiplied by 0 0.2 meters gives us 0 0.1 meters per second is the magnitude of our velocity. It's the speed of our moving conductor as it moves to the right along our x-axis.